Hi guys, it's Jake here from Voice Enthusiast. Oh, we are in a very beautiful studio. This is a green screen here with a lake. No, it's not a green screen. It's a real nature, guys. It's a real nature. I, I kind of fell in love with the, listening to the a cappella versions of songs. And so for today, I have a song across endless dimensions. We know it's an unbelievable song sung by Dimash Kudaybergen. Uh, and right now we will listen to it in an a cappella version. So, are you as excited as I am? If you are, hit the subscribe button and hit the like if you, if you already like it. If you don't, if you don't, don't do it. Let's first listen to the song. You heard how how he went from very light, tender sound to more, you know, round, powerful from the vo very deep vocal chord adduction sound, like very powerful uh, bass baritone section of a voice. From space and time necessary to have an unbelievable ability to manage your air going out of your lungs, the ease of the diaphragm, uh, of the diaphragm uh, moving up and making the air go out of the lungs. You know, the, the cooperation between the diaphragm and the vocal cords it's just, it's just a great example of how, how you can do it in a perfect way. And now he switched from more classical approach where you have a uh, more l lower larynx way and then he he raised the larynx to give this ah eh, more ah eh, sound to uh ah eh. that that's why the sound was so different Oh, 
you can you can see how how he uses the the dynamic range also to to tell the story to make the story more interesting he goes from the low to high to high to powerful to powerful and then again to very bright light and then you can see the sinusoidal uh, tendency of a, of a song in a good way of course Yeah, and, and, and now <laughs> he's just so high, like all of us could, could only dream about those sounds, those notes. It's just, it's just unbelievable how he goes to it like this. Uh, and it's also very, it's not only head voice there, it's also a little bit, a little bit of this chest, uh, of this chest factor in it. That's why it's so mm, so overwhelming, not only coloratura soprano-ish sound. And you heard it, he went from this chesty approach to more open head uh, way of singing. And it was, it was just beautiful. I loved how Dimash uses all the ways of singing. So in, in, in uh, let's say four minutes, he used so many ways of using his, his voice. We had very light piano, very uh, very soprano-like piano. And we had a bass piano where he was also very powerful, but also on the very low notes. Then he went higher to more operatic sound and then to more, uh, a, a more belty way of using his voice. Then he went to the to the soprano area of voice with more squeeze and with more open sound. Uh, Mr. Dimash, if you are listening to it, you are a magician of a voice. Man, it's unbelievable. Guys, we are so lucky we have such talent right now. Oh my. Thank you guys for this one. I hope I hope you like me, not changing the t-shirt, but changing the scenario. Uh, yeah, have you seen the lake? Have you seen the lake? Let me show you. Let me show you the lake. Oh, it's beautiful, isn't it? And yeah, that's all for today, guys. I hope to see you on the next ones and that you are healthy and you're doing fine in the strange times we live, but we have so mm, talented people around us. Let's just share their talents and let's share our passion. Thank you guys for today and see you in the next ones.